there is a danger in growing up in church and being in church every Sunday. I'm not saying it's dangerous to be in church every Sunday. I think it's amazing. But there's a danger if you just come and you let attending church and you let being involved in church and you let knowing all about God be a substitution for actually knowing him and becoming who he created you to be. You can be so busy doing things that you forget to actually be with him and know him and be transformed by him. And you can know so much about him and not know him. It's like a vaccine. It's like you get just enough Jesus to keep you from getting the real thing. And so when you hear the gospel preached, you have enough gospel that you don't even realize your need for the gospel because I, I'm a Christian. I've been in church my whole life. My parents are Christians. My brothers and sisters are Christians. My family are Christians. And the truth of the matter is, is none of that makes you a Christian. It can help lead you to the point where you give your life to Jesus and it can model for you what it looks like to follow Jesus. And all of that is really good. But there has to be that day where you come to the place where I come to the place where we come to the place of seeing our need personally it's one thing to say Jesus died for the whole world it's another thing to say he died and shed his blood and went through everything he went through for me because of my sin I deserved what he took that was should have been me I should have been separated I should have been tormented I should have been shamed and guilty and hung there for the world to mock and ridicule if everything that I have ever done was put on the banner of a newspaper I would be the object of scorn and shame and guilt for the rest of my life and he decided, rather than you take it, I'll take it, and I'll let them hang a banner above my head.